Golly. <laughs> so I had a great idea to to leave after work yesterday. And I didn't get started till about uh, 8 or 9 p.m. And I uh, ended up here in Florida about 2 a.m. <laughs> where we're gonna launch and uh, I was just sitting here thinking uh, when me and Chad get together we always do stuff the hard way um, we should have just paid for a shuttle and not try to do it ourselves because this is kind of a kind of a pain in the butt and Chad doesn't want to admit it but it is um, and anytime we go on these trips, we're, we're never prepared. Um, but we, we do have a lot of fun doing them. And uh, we always say, well, we, we should have brought this or we, we should have done that. But I guess that's what makes it an adventure. <laughs> but it's already 1221 and we're not on the water yet. Uh, but we're almost there. Alright, this is where it gets exciting. Got all the stuff loaded up here. We're gonna put in here at the canoe outpost. And uh, it's pretty cool. They, they'll drop our vehicle off the day we want them to. So there's the Santa Fe River. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you got it. You know that mushroom you saw back there is a choice edible. It's a, it's a um, chicken of the woods, yeah, right? Yeah, I yeah. thought it was. Yeah. That's awesome. I'm, I'm, I'm an amateur mycologist. So yeah, me know. too. So. You know the joke about amateur mycologists, right? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You watch out for them. They've got questionable morale. Yeah, I actually have that shirt. It's oh, worn nice. and old and tattered. <laughs> it's a big old turtle right here. <laughs> Hold them up, let's see them. Yeah. <laughs> Did 
Chad's caught so many fish, he broke both his fishing poles. <laughs> Are both out of commission? Both of them. Ha! That sucker right there is freaking for <laughs> I'll bring you this one here. No, they're in a kayak. Oh, yeah, but he might have been. Huh. Ah. Got another one? Chad's got another bass. It's got to be at least 20 bass he's caught today. Alright, so I guess it's time to start looking for a campsite. Um, I think we're a little behind schedule. <laughs> We've been fishing and playing around all day and and uh, now it's time to find a campsite and we're not in the right spot. But... Huh. A big tree. All right, so I saw that little sign that said post spring and I climbed up here and uh like it's closed off but we're gonna go check it out all right so this is Poe Springs cool huh pretty all right so we're coming in Poe Springs now with my kayak went back and got the boat and we're gonna paddle right in here check it out I just saw a bunch of mullet back there. Well, that's pretty cool. Saw a bunch of turtles back in there swimming around.
we got a late start yesterday so uh, we fished for the first few hours and uh, stopped in here real quick it was right at dark and we did a little stealth camping <laughs> last night um, as you can see we left no trace and this is Poe Springs and we're about to push off and do a little fishing and head on down the river Gotcha. <laughs> Come here, little fella. Yes, sir. How you guys doing? Good man, any luck? Good morning. Yeah, did real good down this last stretch. And... Yo, there you go. Nice. We're trying to scare him your way. <laughs> I don't know why you got loose like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
I thought the lady was saying there's a big gator up ahead. There's some big turtles there. I think she was saying there's a big tree up ahead. Which I got a little access here. Don't be nothing. Maybe she was talking about a big gator. I got hooked up, boy. <laughs> That's your old swanny bass. Is it? Oh, man. Out of your huh. Is it? I don't know. He's, He's got kind of those co that coloration. I'm going to come check it out. Just so you guys know, I'm having a blast out here. 
Uh, we started off this morning, caught fish the whole way down, um, swam in the springs, drank a little beer, um, caught fish, still catching fish, and uh, just having a good time. This is a great river. Oh, this ain't too bad. Yeah. It's gator country, son. Yeah, I got a big old tree. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. That gator will get you first in the tent. Someone decorated a fire right here. Look. Right there is where that wild hog is going to come out tonight. <clears throat> I'll say right there is where that wild hog is going to come out. I'm just going to run right up under my hammock. And then go right over to your tent. <laughs> Looks like we're surrounded by swamp. out there filming this <laughs> You take a look, you can see how flooded the river is here. And uh, last night it was pretty hard to find a campsite in here. Luckily, we found a little piece of land in a swamp. And we tucked up in there. <laughs> but man, it's flooded. <laughs> All right, so we're headed out day three. Uh, we're gonna try to make it down to, probably to Swanee today. And then uh, we'll have just a small paddle, or for me a pedal, uh, down to 340 where we're gonna take out.
All right, it says Inchinatucky two miles, Swanee six miles, Rocks Bluffs 16 miles, uh, Brantford 17 miles. So I'm trying to go to the Inchinatucky right now. There's a spring down there supposedly. Go check it out. All right, so I looked at it wrong. The Inchinatucky's back two miles, so I actually missed that. Huh. Okay. So we got six miles to the Swanee. I think that's where we're going to try to camp tonight. I got these rope swings all over this river, but I don't see where they're swinging from or how they're getting up there to, to swing. <laughs> Must be uh, some kids are pretty good tree climbers. I'd bust my butt on that sucker. Chad thought he outran me, but there he is. <laughs> I've been pedaling for miles trying to catch him. He's in his little speedboat, but little does he know I got the GoPro right there. I'm going to get him. <laughs> so we pull up to this uh, so-called campground with cold beer and snacks and food <laughs> and it looks like it's closed <laughs> oh well boy I was paddling against that wind and it was wearing me out so I dropped the pedal drive and now we're underway the only problem I got with the pedal drive is after a while, the seat on this thing <laughs> starts hurting my ass. <laughs> and I don't have any uh, padding on my ass as it is. So it's just straight bone on wood. <laughs> At least that's what it feels like. Is this someone's house? That is. Yeah. See, last time I, I think I paddled and I parked right on that little beach thing right there and sat there for a minute. Yeah, I can't believe how high you were. I remember coming around that corner. Old Swanee River. I think that was a big, big sturgeon just jumped.
Almost looks like an armadillo it's running around. Yeah, it could be, but it looks, see how there's little hair? I guess that'd be right. I do that kind of weird thing, almost like okay. a little spiral. Your old buddy's fire pit here. Yeah. That probably washed up with the yeah. river is flooded. Huh. Mosquitoes aren't that bad. What's that? The mosquitoes aren't that bad back here. Uh, I, I noticed there are some in my head, not in the inside chamber, but they want to get in. Not like barefooted. It's a little puddle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't think anybody's gonna find us out here tonight. I wonder if it's gonna rain all night. That's look pretty good. Oh, that's pretty good. I think you, you probably would have slept better because every time I went to tossing and turning out here you breathe and stop or the sleep down <laughs> dissipate and Yeah. I thought a big old gator was gonna come up out of that swamp back there and crawl up under here and keep warm under my hammock. I was wondering how many times a gator in the course of history has like come up on somebody's tent or something while they're out camping or something like that I, yeah I never heard of anything you know I'm sure if you google it you'll get something What happened? The river or that pond back here? <laughs> Good old river water. All right, so the final stretch. We ended up camping right there last night, which is a real nice campsite, but the <clears throat> getting up and down from the river was kind of a pain in the butt. I'm sure if I'd be sleeping in that one. It's a little waterlogged. Alright, so that's supposed to be the ending point. The 340 bridge. And uh, if I'm lucky, 
my truck will be sitting there uh, the shuttle service here delivers your truck on the day of pickup which is today and it's almost noon so I'm hoping my truck should be there I guess we're gonna find out <laughs> all right We're done. There it is. Here, grab one side of this here. There you go, let's get up one.